vote, pal Z. So hey loves. Yeah, it's me. Looking like a seafood eater, okay? So just wanted to let you guys know that we came to the balling king crab, I think it is. So yeah, it's about to get popping up in here. <laughs> got the crab legs. I got some mussels and I got some crawfish. Y'all know I'm Louisiana all the way, so yeah, got the crawfish. And that's what hubby got. All his stuff already out. Look at him. <laughs> he ain't wasting no time. <laughs> so what's up, babe? Why ain't shit good? So good morning, y'all. Y'all already know who it is. So we're actually in Dallas right now. Um, I'll tell you guys what's going on later. But anyway, I'm getting up. We got a lot of errands to run while we're down here. So I'm gonna get up and get ready. My hubs is on the computer handling business. I do not have the camera on you, buddy. Don't you worry about that. That's mine, not nobody else's. All right, y'all, so finally we are heading out. And it's a beautiful day outside, so hope you get some stuff together. It's the Cowboy Stadium. Got me all excited about Starbucks. And they played me with the coffee. Oh, it feels so good out here. Like, for real. Babe, what you doing? All right, y'all. So it's a beautiful day out here in Arlington. And hubby gonna drive, I drove here. Something wrong with his foot, I don't know. And he won't take his butt to the doctor, but y'all know how black men are, don't wanna go to the doctor. What you looking at? What you looking at? Oh, it's not good in here. What is that sound? You trying to turn it off? I'm trying to put it down. I'm trying to put it down. I'm trying to put it down. I need to put some mascara on. Come on, brush. Where is it? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's a pretty day out here. What is the temperature? I hear the sun. Oh, it's hot though. Should it get hot down here? I know. I'm pretty sure it get hot down here. Because every time we come down here, it's hot. Anyway, so I told you guys I was going to tell you why we were down here, but um, we are down here trying to see if this is where we actually want to move. So we're just trying to we're gonna go look at some houses and stuff like that just to see if it's something that we're interested in. Um, more than likely, yeah, but of course, you know, you have to spend some time in the area before you just make a decision on where you want to live. But so we figured we'd come down here for a couple of days while I'm on vacation and just try to get a feel of the city and what it has to offer. Uh, you guys know I always come to Dallas for the uh, makeup show. So if we do move here, that'll be a good thing. So I won't have to travel. So the money that I'm saving for traveling, I could be spending it there. But yeah, so that's what we're doing today. So we're just kind of doing that. I'm starving, I'm thirsty. But we got to get some stuff done before, like, 
like everything closes, you know, stuff closes at like five, six o'clock, whatever. So we'll see. Well, at least where we from, I don't know about here, but yeah. So that's what we're doing today. So y'all, yeah, we're, I'm sitting out here waiting on um, them to finish our burgers. Like, I don't know, I'm like, I'm not a big hamburger person whatsoever. But for some reason, like, lately I've been wanting me a good hamburger. Like, I don't eat fast food hamburgers, but I've been wanting me, like, a good homemade type of burger. And so we found this place called Mixed Up Burgers. And so we're going to try it out. The reviews are pretty good on TripAdvisor. We're going to try it out and see how it works. But, y'all, I'm telling y'all right now, like, I'm not for the foolishness of this burger, but not be disgusting. Um, I got the Pedro, I think it is. I think it's what it is. Um, but it's so funny because my husband was like, he was like, I already know which one you're going to get. And then he showed me and I was like, yep, that's it. If it got, if it's a burger with bacon and blue cheese on it, that has my name written all over it, okay? So, yeah, I'm waiting on that. I couldn't sit in there because it is like a sports bar and, you know, I can't take the smell of smoke because I'm not a smoker. So, it literally turns my stomach um, when I smell people smoking and stuff. So, I came to sit in the car. Uh, me and hubby actually both did, but he went back in to go check on the food. So, yeah. But, that's what we're doing. Um, Y'all, I'm really not happy with the houses that we've looked at. Um, I don't think Arlington is going to be the spot for me. Um, and I'm not trying to be bougie or anything like that, but... Like, I'm real picky about the neighborhoods and stuff, and, like, I'm not going to move somewhere like I'm not cool with the neighborhood. So, yeah, I don't think Arlington is going to be it. But, you know, hey, you can't cross everything out. So, uh, but a couple of the neighborhoods we've seen I'm not really excited about. Uh, so, we're going to go to Grand Prairie. Grand Prairie is where I initially want to stay at, but I'm not sure. So, it's going to be between Louisville, Grand Prairie, and... Um, Maybe like Copel or something like that. We so. got our food. Got us some milkshakes. Got us our food. I forgot to tell you guys, me being a greedy person, should I say. I uh, also got some chili cheese fries. And the lady said it was a large order, so my husband's going to share them with me. But he didn't part the house screwed up, so... He called us up trying to fix the way you park. I just need him to come on because I'm starving right now. Like, for real. But it feels so good out here and it's so pretty. go into the studio movie grill. Oh, I gotta do something about this. Uh-uh. I think I forgot my powder. But anyway, we're about to go see um, Fate and Furious. I'm waiting on hubby. He on a Marco Polo app. So, yeah. Flex medium. Flex, break, spin. Easy for every day. You've been watching Screen Visions front and center. We put you front and center on real food. Down. And sprint. Next time, get here early. So, hey, loves. I'm in Target right now trying to find me something to wear to the pool that's her big collar hello so anyway I'm trying to find me some swimwear um i don't know i don't want all my shit out <laughs> i ain't trying to have all my everything out let me see oh this is cute What you think about this one? Like, it's on clearance too, look. 
Oh, such a man. Regular 40. I'm gonna sell for $19.99. Let me get this. I don't guess I need to cover nothing. Yeah. Anyway. I like this little cover right here. Yeah, I like that. All right, let me get this little suit and then try to find me something in clearance. Target and I ended up getting the um excuse me out. I ended up getting the bathing suit with the cover up so I'll show you guys what alright so I ended up getting this bathing suit right here and you can see it was $39.99 on clearance for $19.98 so that's nice and then that is the back, which I think is super cute. <laughs> and it covers the bomb because I ain't trying to be showing all that. And then the cover up, which is see through. Hubby approved. And then there you go. It's on clearance for $9.98. So I didn't want to do all black, but hey, it's cute and it was cheap. So, so I need to check and see if. They um came in and gave us new towels. I know they made up the bed like there's like we asked. Um so yeah, we got new towels and everything, so that's cool. Look at my mess I left y'all. Like this is horrible. Look at this. Hubby rushing me out today. But I must say I have gone back to my chocolate palette and now I remember why I love it so much. Like I love this thing. So pigmented. And I love these little shirts from Old Navy. I got a couple of them in different colors. Yesterday I had on the um, peach color one. So yeah. See? I need this mirror. Right here? I need this mirror. In my life. Plus on top of that. Yes. Okay. They know to keep that girl's heart, but Sheraton, I'm going to need y'all to get this bathroom bigger than this because I can't see how close those are. Like, yeah, I'm going to need them to get that together. But in the meantime, I like it. So for lunch, as y'all saw, we ate um, Wingstop. Hubby wanted wings out today, so that was cool. It was good. I realized that I don't like their lemon pepper wings. They are too salty for me, so. But I do like Louisiana rub, of course. So, I had a question for y'all. Here's what I was thinking. I was thinking that I want to change my um, social media name. Like, I'm thinking of changing my channel to my name versus um louisiana mrs because i don't know i think that if i'm going to be working on like you know my brand type of thing then um i think that i really need to change my name i don't know y'all tell me what you think do you think i should leave it at louisiana mrs or do you guys think that I should probably change it to be more relatable, I should say, to uh, my name. So, I don't know. Y'all let me know what y'all think on that because, like, I'm really contemplating it, but I just don't know. So, please let me know in the comment section. Um, again, like I was, I had been contemplating if I should, to, you know, continue to do a vlogs, but um, because I don't know if that's the content that you guys want to see. Or if I should just do straight um, content videos, which is like beauty content or whatever. 
so I don't really know. I'm still deciding on it. Just based off of, um, you know, I'm not complaining or anything, but I do feel like I put a lot of work into my videos. So, as in anybody else on YouTube, I mean, I just have to put it out there like that. But I really want to know what you guys enjoy. So, you know, because that's what it's for. It's for you guys to kind of see snippets of in my life and things that I like and stuff like that. So, I just really want to know. Do you guys think that, are you guys interested in the vlogs? Are you, do you think I should continue the vlogs? Or should I just do, you know, content videos or just nothing at all? I mean, it's just, it's a simple question. And I feel like you guys, as my viewers, that you guys should, you know, give me information on that. Because it's what you want to see. So, yeah. And if you guys have any requests, let me know. Um, as you guys know, I just did a request a video that... Definitely, I put a lot into because I had to find the product, but hey, I don't mind doing that for you guys. Like I said, you guys are my viewers, and that's what I do things for. So, you guys, let me know what you think. Uh, let me know if you think I need to be a little more creative. I don't know. I just, I need your input so I know what you guys like, okay? So, yeah, that's pretty much what I wanted to ask you guys about that, but I really do think that I'm going to um, change my name uh, on my social media stuff, so... You guys let me know and I think now is the time to do it because um, my channel is not really high like that like high subscribers or views or whatever and um, you know like my Instagram and all that kind of stuff I think it's probably time that I do it sooner than later um, so it doesn't make a big difference I guess I should put it like that so you guys let me know what you think and I definitely appreciate any input that you guys put in the box below We went to the little liquor spot, but I wanted to go get some produce from over there, which my husband didn't even wait on me to get no produce. He went and got what he needed for the drinks and was like, come on. I was like, oh, damn, I thought I came in for the produce. <laughs> he was trying to get the hell out of there because he was ready to buy everything, like, for real. So, finally made husband make a decision. <laughs> Actually made a decision for him. It was supposed to rain, and he was concerned about it, but I was like, fuck it. You want to go? We going. So... We went to Walmart and got some Texas Rangers gear. I don't know why it's showing up orange on this camera. Because it's red and blue. And the hat. So, yeah. And then, we got this one. And then we got matching hats. And then he just made my drink. Bloody Mary. Alright y'all, we headed to the Rangers. I'm bloody Mary's on the way because I know we don't have to toss the cup. I ain't drinking no bloody Mary. <laughs> what are you drinking? I forgot. I'm drinking a jalapeno margarita. Jalapeno margarita. Hey, but it ain't no warm margarita, nigga. <laughs> it's straight liquor. I ain't approved of margarita, nigga. <laughs> what the hell is a warm margarita? Hey, that is, this ain't approved. <laughs> this is Texas margarita. This bitch ain't approved. <laughs> Did they send you the tickets? Oh, 
Sign up today. Call 1 866 TXU or visit TXU.com slash season pass. Inspired by you. TXU Energy. Shit, my husband just bought this damn shish kebab. Like, seriously? Hey, that bitch two feet. That bitch long. back to the room it started raining right when we got to the hotel so it's perfect glad we left when we did but anyway um i'm so mad i didn't get my sweet corn because that's all i freaking hear about is sweet corn going to dallas so i'm mad but i don't know you always mad shut up all of my bees and ass but um anyway so we walked back i got a slight headache but i think it's because of that cap I'm not used to wearing a hat I'm on my head. I'm trying to count this way because my nuts is out. <laughs> Boy, ain't about to study your nuts. Some nuts. <laughs> ain't about to study your nuts. Anyway. They horse nuts too, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure all the men that watching would love to hear that. I ain't talking about no fucking men. I'm talking about no women. You want to see long, big jokes. <laughs> big, big Willie. <laughs> hey, son. You want to spell long dick? L O. <laughs> so, I think we end for the night because it had a tornado warning. So she is for the night. I'm finna hit B Live Dallas. You ain't finna hit a damn thing but that B. Where finna, you at? I'm finna hit that strip club in Dallas, babe. I got some partners about to come holler at me. You ain't finna hit nothing but that B right where you at. So, what else? Fucking with me. Yeah. Wait till she go to sleep and hit that B Live. Yeah, okay. You gonna be V dead. But anyway. So yeah, I'm about to, I don't know what I'm about to do right now. I'm about to take some of this to leave because my head is killing me. But I don't know if I should take it though because I've been drinking. So I don't know. I've been drinking. I've been drinking. All right, y'all, the Uber food, the Uber just dropped off the food. So let's see what we got. That must be mine right there. The tuna sashimi. That's his roll. I guess that's, is that my sauce or your sauce? This must be my sauce. Did you get some wasabi? Big old water, sir. Wait a long ass time for this shit. Good morning, y'all. So, just sitting up here. Gonna get ready to check out of the hotel. So, uh, we got some stuff accomplished. Um, some houses that we want to, um, that we're interested in. But now we just have to narrow our area down and see if it's really what we want to do. So, yeah. Um, also, we're getting ready to um, head out, but we are uh, staying in Shreveport tonight because we have my mom bringing the kids to meet us in Shreveport so they can have, um, you know, the weekend up there. So that way they'll be able to do something for their spring break because they're on spring break this week and I was on vacation this week. So we had to get, um, we had to come to Dallas and like I said, get some stuff done, but then I still want them to be able to do something for the weekend, too. So, that's why we're going to meet up in Shreveport and stay there for Saturday and Sunday. So, that's what we're going to do. And hopefully, we can get them in the pool or whatever. But the weather is looking kind of shady. You know what I'm saying? Like, literally and figuratively speaking. So, um, I just got my hair down in a low uh, ponytail. I should have put it up in a bun. But, it's whatever. It's whatever. So anyway, yeah, um, I'm actually wearing a blue jean dress. Let me show you guys. See, yeah, that's what it looks like. But anyway, I'm actually wearing a blue jean dress, and I don't know. 
Um, I'm going to wear my little slippers. I think I got, I showed you guys in a clip already what they look like. I'm trying to figure out should I wear my BB slippers or should I wear my, um, my other little thong sandals. I'm going to show you guys. Let's see, these right here are what I'm going to go ahead and wear. Or, I'm trying to decide on, or my BB slippers. Um, honestly, the thong slippers are cute. I actually bought those at Walgreens, go figure, for like $9.99. Um, I ended up um, going to get my toes done, and I didn't have any, um, I realized I never bought any slippers or anything, so I don't mess up my paint or whatever. And so I just went to Walgreens right next door to the nail shop, got them. It's so cute. My daughter was with me, so she picked them. And so that's what we did. But I love them. I just don't like, I don't like how thong slippers have that flap sound, like flap, flap. You know what I mean? So I don't know, but they comfortable. Shockingly Walgreens, right? Everybody's so shocked when I say that. But anyway, and those um, BB slippers. Y'all never believe where I got those from. Like, I got them from Burlington. And I don't even go in Burlington, but my mom was, um, it was Easter, the day before Easter. And we were in there. My mom wanted to go in and look and everything. And so I went in there and I saw them. I was like, oh, these are so cute. And I mean, you know, they are cute. I'm just saying. And they had the olive green ones too. And they were $16.99. Yes, they were. I'm not lying to you. $16.99. Well, we made it to Shreveport, so back at it again in another one. What's up, y'all? We got the family together. Y'all see everybody hiding? They go, Davino. It is cold out here, unusually cold out here. We well, wouldn't expect this when it's about to be made. Let's read it back there. <laughs> and the boys are up there. <laughs> that looks so much alike. It's so free. Look oh at that. <laughs> <laughs> I take the front pocket. Demia is still with her aunt, so she ain't won't come. Not nah, she is. <laughs> but anyway, we are in Shreveport, like I told you guys, and my mom brought the kids to us, so we're about to go eat at our favorite steak spot, which is salt. Grass. What did he say, Lacey? He said you want to go check the menu? No. <laughs> I wasn't expecting you to say that. <laughs> I was not expecting you to say that. <laughs> oh, 
Boy, you gonna bust them shoes up. <laughs> <laughs>